What's going on, guys? And welcome back to a mega stupid haul video. Now, to kick things off, I'm going to start way back in August. So, August 1st, I went to the Lego store down at Miramar and wanted to pick up the ATT. Unfortunately, they didn't have that. But what I did pick up was a nano gauntlet for my wife because she has the other gauntlet. I picked her up the small Disney castle. To go along with the small Disney castle, I got the big Disney castle for her since I'm trying to get her into the Legos. And while I was there, I got the small Lego store, the last one they had in store. And then the forest hideout freebie. Also in August 1st, I pre-ordered a few items. So I pre-ordered the Galaxy Explorer and I pre-ordered the office set. So I got one and it's definitely a cool kit to see, especially with the same box. And then also I got the office set. This is one of my favorite shows and I do enjoy the, the set now, so I'm gonna try to build that. Now, while I was at Costco, there they had Lego sets of Marvel. My wife likes Marvel um, as well as Disney things, so I got her Lego set. And they had a two-in-one Lego Marvel set, so I picked this up for her so that way she can start building because I'm trying to get her into Lego. <laughs> as well as in the month of August, I went to visit the Brick Mania Sister Store to Miramar Mission Vallejo store and so I drove from Camp Pendleton all the way up there and back in one day. And I got a few items. So I got a few of the instructor packs. A few more of the Marine Rare 2s because I can never get enough of those. Not just one, but four PJs. few Lando's Randos that I got and some printed pieces and elements. So I got another Venom and Viper combo to go to my collection and two more of my Humvee because I never really had them in my collection but now I have two. So I got two more CH-53Es so making it four. Another Seahawk and a second hind actually with the bigger box. Now I've been collecting a lot of the V-22s and I have every single version. So now I have the Air Force CV-22. But that was not the last thing I got. And from this haul I just get one, but two LCACs. Now the two LCACs were from both the Miramar and Mare Island stores. I also picked up online when they went live another Growler. It's also able to pick up the Task Force Humvee from Black Hawk Down the CHP helicopter. And I was able to find another high, but in a medium sized box. So I have one big and one medium sized box. Also in the Miramar store, they have the skid loader from Eclipse Graphics. Most of you will recognize it from Battlefield 3 and 4 in one of the famous maps they had. So Brick Mania has been coming out with a lot of Ukrainian benefit kits that I actually really enjoy. And I was able to try to at least collect all the kits that I, I enjoy. I was able to pick up the Barricada, drone that's been used in the Ukraine war. The T-64 BV, two BTR-4s, two BMP-2s, the T-80 BMV or the captured Russian tank, also known as the Bunny. And I was able to trade for the V-1 of the Ghost of Kiev. So now I have V-1, all I need is the V-2. So someone on Facebook Marketplace was selling the original F-4U Corsair. And I picked it up because Brick Veteran and Brick Mania are both coming out with new updated ones. So I want to add to my collection. I already opened this box because I didn't know exactly what I got. But I also I got another Growler. And I didn't get more PJs, but I got more figures. Some of these packages, I don't know what I got. So I'm just going to open them. I traded for these figures. So I got two more of the... These are the Humvee exclusive minifigures. Special Forces Seals. And I got two more of the German Special Forces. And then two more of the Little Green Men. And then also the ATV French Special Forces figure. A lot of these packages, I'm not sure what I got. But I'm pretty sure it's many figures. So yeah, these are a lot of the cab figures as well as I think these are the K2 or KA52 alligator figure. And then a lot of just torsos, seal from Vietnam. All brick mania for many figures. 
order from Brick Designer, and I believe either this is the MRAP or it's going to be the JLTVs. Yeah, so these are the MRAP pieces, and I got four of each because I like to over be overboard. <laughs> now, this is packages from Evan. I'm not sure what is in it because it's been about two months since I probably either did a trade or ordered from the person. It's Pentagon Magnet. That's pretty cool. Oh, it's the Generals. Haha, forgot. I ordered the Generals or I had someone pick them up from the Capital Store. So, able to get that. This package is from Thomas. And this is, I believe, Chessie Puller, I think. Yeah, it's a Chessie Puller figure. Another package from Thomas. He had the Miramar pack. So now I have another one of these. But for, it's going to be for my dad for his birthday and Christmas combo. This package is from Ethan. I just don't remember what I got from him. Ah, uh, yes, I now I remember. I did a trade with them. So for two more U.S. Marine Riflemen Modern, V1. Another one of the Neptune Spear Seals. Now this package is from Brickforce. You know him as Brickforce on Brick Discord or Sayer underscore Levi, I believe. That's his Instagram. But yeah, I bought his hip and his, I think, one of the Russian vehicles that he had. As you can see, it came in pieces, but it's all still there. It happens when the kits are sent as a full assembled or half assembled. But it happens, you know, it happens in the mail. But this is from Levi. This is his card from Brick Fair, Virginia, where he and Dan were both at the same time. So they got to both have the hip and Dan's hip together. So as you can see, there's pieces in there, but I appreciate Levi and definitely go check him out on Instagram and Discord. Now this package is from at ATBR underscore Ick or at Brick on Instagram. And he got he was able to allow me to buy the CV280, I think it was. He also was, gave me a few free items too. That's pretty cool. Like on Rapid Christmas. So yeah, the CV9030N infantry fighting vehicle, which is the Norwegian APC that Andreas built. So now I have this one and his other vehicles that he's made. This one's from a gentleman named Ellen, who is on Discord. We were talking about how he had all the pieces for the OG V22 that Brickmania came out with. As you can see, I have pretty much all the pieces for to make the OG B22 without the stickers and minifigures. Now, in the beginning of September, Brickmania had a Labor Day sale, and it went from not only the 15% off, but it had every single day of the four day weekend, there was a different sale that extended until the end of Labor Day. So, I was able to pick up a few items from Brickmania Miramar. Big bag. So I was able to pick up the F-16 Fighting Falcon, the LRV, the Perseverance, another Seahawk, because I have now four, I think. And if I didn't have any bigger kits before, well, I have another bigger kit, which is the Mark V Sock. And it's definitely huge, and actually the packaging is made pretty well to where it's like sticking out. It's pretty awesome. So I have a buddy that's close to one of the other Brickmania stores. So I was able to have him on the Labor Day weekend sale pick up a few kits for me. This is box one of two for all the kits. So I got the fourth Seahawk and the KA-52 as a full kit. Box number two. Got two more AAVs, but one's for Shy. And then the... Sue 27. I was, wasn't able to get pick this up when we had it in store, but I'm glad that Chicago had it. So I got this another big package, but I'm not sure 
what's in it. I know it sounds like Lego at least, but yeah, definitely I'm gonna open it and see what I honestly forgot what I got. Ah, oh. it's the fourth CH53E Super Selling. I bought it off of someone that was selling it on Facebook Marketplace. That's where it was from. Yep. So now I have four. A couple months back, we opened the Brick Mar Marimar store. And we had a specific big kit that was sitting there for months, months and months until it retired back in March timeframe. And then someone came in and actually bought it. Well, this customer has come in multiple times and we got to, I got to talk to him a lot. And he told me about how he, he still had it. And I was told him, I was like, yeah, I've been looking for one. There was one of the brick manor resellers anyway. So he's like, yeah, I mean, if I still have it, I'm not going to do anything with it. It's still sealed and everything. I'll sell it to you. So... I was able to get the Brick Mania AC-130. So I've wanted this kit for a while. So now I have three big freaking kits. And this is one that I'm going to cherish for a while. Eventually I'll build it, but not now. So as I was editing the haul video, three more packages showed up. I forgot that completely forgot about these packages. They weren't supposed to arrive as I was recording um or as i was editing but they are now here and i'm going to add them to this haul so this one's from ebay i bought technically i bought it from ebay so i was able to find the og f35b that cody made and was also able to get the gold or the yellow jayhawk now i know exactly what this is this is from brick mania it's the ukraine hind because i now have two russian hinds so i had to get this one because there's only a limited of i think 50 that were in production I'm definitely excited to build this one, this one, and compare the two, the Russian Hind versus the Ukrainian, even though they're the very similar builds, but definitely wanted to compare the both of them. Now, this one is from one of my good buddies that we did a trade and everything with, and I wasn't expecting this to come in. Honestly, I wasn't wondering where it's going to be, everything like that, because it was coming from overseas. But definitely, I believe this is the two different kits. Funny enough, this is the same kit, the same box I sent him his kit in. So this one is the OG V22. This is a COVID kit, actually, because it's similar boxing as I got for the BTR. But yeah, this is the, actually it says quarantine edition back, which is pretty cool. But yeah, this is the OG Abrams. So battle brick minifigure, that's cool. Two different patches, multiple patches. Wow, these are actually pretty cool. So there's different, looks like different squadrons or different units. And then it looks like a container. That's pretty cool. These are like mini fit. I think these are mini fit cat boxes. Got a lot of big hands. Oh, there, this I go. I like how he packaged everything. And then he, we traded for the V1 deck crew. I think this is, yeah, the Call of Duty. Mega blocks. Although I don't collect them, but it was a gift, so I do appreciate it. This is by far probably one of the biggest, if not will be ever, the biggest hauls that I've ever done. It just in kit size to kit quantity. I am definitely happy that I was able to collect all these and put them in my collection. But if you definitely like the video, let me know in the comments below and definitely give this video a like. But thank you for stopping by and we'll see you in the next video.